This is the new Nerf Zombie Strike Revoltinator. Howdy all you cowboys, cowgirls, gunfighters, and Nerf enthusiasts. This 2019 Nerf Revoltinator Blaster is available at Target or Amazon or probably just about anywhere Nerf blasters are sold. And I know some of my regular viewers don't care much for the plastic or toy gun reviews on this channel, but you all have to understand that I've got to share my passion and love for all things with a trigger. And Nerf blasters are fun at any age. Like I say, when the real guns go away, the toy guns come out to play. So whether you're here for yourself or you're shopping for your kids or grandkids, or if you're just a fan of the show, I appreciate you watching. Never grow up. Included in the package with this blaster is the blaster, of course. One cool magazine that looks like it was cobbled together out of some sort of diamond plate steel. Eighteen Nerf darts. And of course, the instructions. The Revoltinator is essentially a Strife reshell, and it's the first flywheel blaster in the Zombie Strike lineup. For those viewers that are unfamiliar with what that means, the Revoltinator has wheels that begin spinning when the rev trigger is pressed. Then when the trigger is pulled, a rod pushes a dart between those spinning wheels, and those wheels then propel a dart out the barrel. Previous Zombie Strike series blasters have all been spring-powered. The Zombie Strike line is known for having really cool aesthetics. All of them are designed to look like they were put together in some post-apocalyptic world that is overrun with zombies. But this particular blaster has some design elements that we haven't seen on any others in the Zombie Strike series. First off is this cool light up Nerf logo. Then when you press the rev trigger, it will go into one of two sound and light effect modes. One of those modes lights up the Nerf logo and then starts these little lights spinning around this electric coil looking thing back here. It spins faster as the motors rev faster. And on every other pull of the trigger, again, the Nerf logo lights up, and then these, what I assume to be spark plugs, light up in sequence. And more lights and sounds happen when you pull the trigger. This translucent bar across the top shows a beam of light shooting towards the muzzle end of the blaster, as if you were charging your darts with some sort of high voltage. Of course, there are lots of other details on the blaster for kids of all ages to muse over. 9 volt batteries here, rebar and electrical conduit here, there's a circuit board and more batteries, and a shock absorbing spring. All these items are just for looks and to spark the imagination, and that's one of the things I think this blaster does quite well. Sparks the imagination. It's a blaster that can be played with and enjoyed even if you're in a situation where you can't fire darts out of it. It just has enough other lights and sounds happening to make it fun as just a toy blaster. And you can increase the playability of this blaster by adding more accessories onto the front barrel attachment or to the Nerf attachment rail on the top of the carry handle. Oh, I don't know. I suppose the stock could be a little longer so that it could be shouldered more comfortably for an adult sized person. In my opinion, this blaster is a winner. 
It's the most fun I've had with a Nerf Blaster in a long time. This one just thrills me. It has great playability, you can achieve a good rate of fire with it, and in the several weeks I've been playing with it around the studio, in the house, and out in the yard, I haven't had any sort of jams or malfunctions. All in all, this blaster gets two gunfighter thumbs up from me. What about you? Do you have this blaster? What do you think of it? And if you don't have this blaster, do you plan on purchasing it? If so, I'll leave a link where you can purchase one down in the description box below. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up by clicking on that like button. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my time traveling adventures. I'm Jedi Knight, and I'll see you in some other place in some other time. Should have loaded this for the outro.